The Star of Hydaelyn has a history older than many know, often full of tales of tragedy and loss. Thousands of years ago, during the Third Astral Era, the primal Sophia was summoned on the continent of Mericidia. As the Empire of Alag assaulted the continent to continue its conquest of the world, the peoples of Mericidia rose up against them, and in their desperation and suffering summoned primals to counter their foe. The story of Equilibrium is that of a daughter and the goddess she summoned. Mericidia has a vast coastline where many of her people live. A lone woman stands atop a cliff by the sea, her white dress stained with blood. She recalls her mother sitting by the hearth, the torn uniform of her husband who was lost in the war against Alag and Han, with naught but the memory of their final words unsaid to cling to. The certainty of family and home is now broken and lost. All that remains is grief made into a weapon. That pain of loss is turned upon the daughter, and while being beaten by her mother, she remembers the story of a goddess and calls to her. Her prayer spoken, Sophia is called forth to the world with a proclamation. All must be in balance. Dark must have light. Loss beget loss. And with balance will your peace be restored. It is implied here that the blood of the daughter's dress was her mother's, who she had murdered, and now she is the last of her family, standing alone on the cliff. The goddess implores her for balance, one final step to leave an empty hearth down by the sea. Whether Equilibrium recounts a literal telling of Sophia's summoning, or merely a tale told by those without an answer, is unknown. But we can say of the time in which it took place, its tragedy was likely all too common and real. This content was brought to you by the Eorzean Archives. If you enjoyed this video, help us please the 12 by leaving a like and subscribing for new content every Thursday and comment down below with any topic you'd like to see our Archons cover in the future. For even more content, discussion, and exclusives, please check out our Discord and consider supporting us on Patreon.